Yo, what's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. How y'all doing? Hey, the kids. I'm Q the Costa Rican, and today we are back with some more Pokemon Scarlet and Violet random Wi Fi battles. Today it's March 10th, guys, and you know what that means. If you don't know, it's Mario Day. I don't know when this, like, quote unquote, Mario Day started going into effect. I feel like it, it ha it's been like the past five ish years where they started recognizing it. I I'm not entirely sure. If you know, let me know in the comment section down below. Regardless, it's March 10th. Mario Day. Uh, so we're using a Mario-esque theme team, guys. We got Probo Pass, Mario. We got Breloom, who's Yoshi, who could have also been Luigi, but I feel like he looks more like a Yoshi than a Luigi. Uh, and then we got Lilligant, regular, as Princess Peach. And then we got Lilligant Hisui as Daisy. Hello. And then we got Blastoise as Bowser, and then Cyclozar as Bowser Jr. Now, there was probably some better Bowser Jr. ideas, i.e. like pre-evolutions like Turtwig or War Turtle even could have been funny. But I figured the team kind of needed the support of Cyclozar. We are running Shedtail Scum strategies, all right? But I think the team needs it. If we can get a Shedtail up and set up uh, Lilligant or Blastoise behind a sub and Quiver or Shell Smash, shit can kind of get crazy. We also have Spore on our Breloom to uh you know further enable that we got three grass types on our team guys okay you know what i'm saying like we needed all the help we can get some honorable mentions um i think gardevoir could have also been like princess peach or rosalina or something to that degree um torko i was thinking of putting on the team but then i was like he kind of looks like an old man so i couldn't really justify him being bowser jr i guess you could you could also argue that like cyclozar is not bowser jr either because he's not small but like i'm doing my best guys um but yeah, Torko would have really put the team together, you know what I'm saying, with like the chlorophyll synergy and stuff like that. But I was like, eh, fuck it. Um, we're rocking out with what we're rocking out with, and we're going to hopefully do our bestest. Uh, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys thought of the team, as well as any other new Pokemon you guys might want to see us use in the future. A little bit of an immersion break here. I am starting a new job. Very The past couple of days, I started a new job. So if I do sound a little tired, there's your reason. All right. Um... That's all I got to say about that. If you guys want to use the team for yourself, the team ID is in the right-hand corner. GC2M85. Yo. Mario did not come out in 1985, did it? Hold on. That'd be crazy if it did. Mario debut. Hold on. 1981. So close. That would have been insane. Anyways, with that being said, guys, I hope you all liked the video. I hope you all subscribe if you're new. And I hope you all have a great Mario day. And I also hope you all enjoy the battles. Bro, I feel like every time I look for random battles on my alt account, we run into fucking monotype, but that's fine. We're both running three. We're both running themes, which are pretty cool. If you guys skip the intro, it's March 10th, baby. AKA Mario Day. I don't know when that um first started being acknowledged as Mario Day. Maybe it's been going on for longer than I thought, but I think it's only been like in the past like five-ish years. I don't know. Regardless, um, rocks look great. Let's click it and see where the day takes us. Um, Lilligant, kind of useless. That's not true. We can, uh, we can, we can Leaf Blade spam. Maybe. We have, we have Leaf Blade, right? We have Leaf Blade. Let's fucking go. And, uh, we also do have Scummy Shed Tail strategies as well as Spore. So, yeah, these are the Mons. Mons. Yeah, these are the Mons that I went with for the Mario theme. Um... Yoshi could have been Luigi. Breloom could have been Yoshi or Luigi. I felt like he looked more like a Yoshi than a Luigi. But, uh, you know, you let me know in the comment section down below. Let's get it popping, man. Let's see how it goes. Also, honorable mentions, because I guess, like, in case you skip the intro, I know a lot of people do. Um, Gardevoir could have also been, like, Peach or Rosalina or some shit. But I was like, eh. I'm just going with, like, some of the main guys. Could have also had DK on here. But then I would have made that Rillaboom. And I would have had four grass types. So it would have, it would have, it would have been bad. Uh, they do lead off with Ghost of Flame. So they lead off with this. Which is muy interesante. I think I want to just throw off a Thunder Wave. Like, I do think rocks are really nice. But I'm just going to throw off a Thunder Wave. And see what happens. They nasty plot. Okay, so this is a Zorark. So that's good to know. This is a Zorark. Big Thunder Wave happening. Because ain't no way... Ain't no way Cerulege clicking nasty plot. You know what I'm saying? So I will click Stealth Rock and then see what happens. We are faster, which is amazing. Can they still break us down to 30? I'd appreciate it. No. Ooh, I'm going to Volt Switch. 
I'm gonna save my fucking sturdy and cuss that. Holy shit. Uh, wait, I don't want to vote switch into anything, though. This mod kind of fucks. <laughs> this mod, like, really, really fuck. Oh, wait, no, it's nasty. Wait, what are they gonna click here? Focus Blast or Shadow Ball, I guess? They could click Flamethrower. It's very free. Um, I'm just gonna vote switch then. Like, I really don't care. Like, I don't want to. I don't care about keeping this. Oh my god, I was a crit. Never mind. Maybe we keep Mario alive. Bro was supposed to be a suicide lead, but homie is popping the fuck off. Anyways, uh, I guess I'll go into Cyclozar. Kind of a kind of really necessary in this matchup. I really like this Pokemon here. But I mean, if they get full parrot or they go for Shadow Ball, uh, then we're, then we're sitting pretty. But they could also go for Focus Blast, and they go for the Dark Pulse instead, which doesn't kill us, by the way. Doesn't kill us, by the way. Amazing. Perfect. So, Shiny Zoroark out of the way. They were expert belt. Okay. Kind of wish they would have clicked Shadow Ball there. But unfortunately, they did not. Alright, so... Whatever comes in, I think I U-turn on to try and get some HP back. Or maybe I just knock something off because... We're super effective on everything. And we should outpace everything besides, like, Scarf, Basque, Legion... Uh, they're gonna go out into Mimikin, so I'm actually gonna do what I said I was gonna do earlier, and I'm actually gonna U-turn. And then, we're gonna get our guy in. Because they probably Sword Stance here, if I had to guess. So yeah, we break his disguise. Huh? Red card? Whoa, please give me Probo Pass. Mario, Mario, Mario. I want Mario. Oh, the game is so good to me! Let's fucking go. They play rough immediately. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'm just gonna Steel Beam. If they have Drain Punch, whatever. They have Shadow Claw. Does this kill me? Wow, that did zero. Wait, Steel Beam's gonna bring me back. Oh my god. Wait, Steel Beam's gonna bring me down on my Cuss Stab. And I'm gonna be able to go for it again unless they go out into a Shadow Sneaker. Or I guess Basket Legion with Aqua Jet. This is so sick. Golden Soul. Okay, they might have Aqua Jet, but like, I don't care. I'll go for Thunder Wave in the off chance they... Yeah, I'll just go for Thunder Wave. I think that's better. Did they go for Aqua Jet? Everybody wants to know. They did. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. So, I mean, we didn't get the sturdy custom shenanigans to pop off, but we did get the... um. We did, we did, we did a lot with this Pokemon. Honestly, we did a lot more than I thought we were gonna do. I want to check my stats because they were supposed to be like zero IVs in my defenses, so that I could, you know, die faster or like get my sturdy broken faster. But it looks like they didn't do that. Unfortunate as it is. Okay. Anyway, so what's in? I have three Grass types to go against this guy. Um, I could just go in a Breloom and click Spore. That's a thing I could do. Um, that is a thing I could do. I could probably shell smash. Like, the world's my oyster here, I think. I think I can't make a bad play. Unless I go into this and miss. Um, I kind of want to show everyone off. So, we're going to go into Yosh. And we're clicking Spore, baby. We're clicking Spore. Something's going to sleep. Right now. They could go into Cerro Ledge on some crazy shit. Like, not, not now, but like after. Which I'm fine with. We do get the Spore off. Go to sleep, brother. Go to sleep. The good news is, we'll probably be able to put a few things to sleep here. Actually, I guess well, we're most likely getting a second battle in. So never mind. I don't have to use every single Pokemon in this first one. Uh, anyways, Bullet Seed it is. Let's go. This will kill. Big Yosh. Big Yosh getting a KO. And we get another guaranteed Spore. Unless the Serra Ledge is in fact Terra Grass. Which it definitely can be. But then that means they'd Swords Dance. And then I can Rock Tomb. Ghost Flume. Yeah, so let's see. Are you Terra Grass? I mean, a lot of them are. You know, a lot of them are. Maybe I should just Rock Tomb. Yeah, I, I, I convinced myself. Okay, they don't. Wow. So I don't think this will kill. But it will lower speed. Big damage. It'll lower speed if I land, please. Oh, you're so good, Yosh. It. Oh, they were Sash. 
Speed fell. So they're going to be at plus one speed. I should have spored. I definitely should have spored. Oh my god, and their weakness, Polise. Oh. Oh. Wait, they're only plus one speed. Daisy's faster. I literally click Aerial Ace. Oh my god. Let's fucking go. I'm going to click Spore on the off chance they do some crazy shit. They just Terror Blast just to do it, I guess. I don't know. We get to click Aerial Ace, meaning we can't miss. Thank god we're Scarf Days E. And also thank god we clicked Rock Tomb. I get Spore into Rock Tomb would have been a lot safer, but you know, I'm not I'm not smart, I guess. Wow, I really thought Blastoise was gonna be able to just clutch up and win. Like I I would totally go out into it right now. I just don't know if plus one poltergeist like guarantee kills me. Um anyways, but Aerial Ace guarantee kills this. Are you really terrestrializing, bro? What are you trying to do here? Brother. They don't, oh, they don't, they don't know. They don't know I got that scarf on me. Daisy keeps that scarf on her, bro. I don't know if you realize, I don't know if you read the lore. Daisy keeps that motherfucking thing on her. Hell yeah. Get him out of here, coach. Why are we faster? They're, they're, why are they faster? They're thinking. Because I rock tombed you, buddy. Therefore, you only had one speed boost. And young Daisy is in. I might just tear a flying Dazer. What's coming in next? Reaper Soul. Reaper, I barely even know it. Oh, this fucking guy. Um, they could Wisp, which would be probably the most annoying thing. They saw my scarf! I uh, totally could pivot in a Bows. Like, do they click? What do they click here? They got a Wisp. I'm just gonna knock it off. I'm just gonna knock it off. I'm actually glad we didn't get to do the Shed Tail stuff, because, like, it's a very scummy strategy, but I was like, this team kind of it kind of needs it, kind of doesn't. They do Wisp and they miss because they're bad at the game. And I'm going to be able to get a full power knockoff off. Blunder policy? No, that would have been sick though, right? Blunder policy Will-O-Wisp would have been insane. Alright, um, big knock. Fuck your lefties. I go acapella. And then I get to... I out of sack until they kill me. And then I'll go into something else. Um, I might just blast... I, I could probably still blast those, yeah. Fuck your lefties. And then we'll see what happens here. They shot... Brother. Do you not know what I am? Are you okay? <gasps> Do they know? Are they gonna forfeit? No. Do they not have a... Attacking move to hit me? Willow... Okay, I mean... Okay. I mean, I don't want to be in front of the fucking... I don't want to be in front of the fucking guy... Are they just like Shadow Punch, Shadow Sneak, will o -Wisp? Like, what is the set? If they Pain Split here, I'm going to be so pissed. But I'm going to... I don't think this kills. Yeah, that's fine. Like, I, I want, I just don't want to be in front of... The... Well, I guess... Never mind. I, I guess I shouldn't have been worried about the... Go Lurk, because they can't set up and beat me. Yeah, I guess I should have never cared. Oh, well. If you Pain Split, you're so real. Substitute. Okay, so they could not hit me. Okay. That's what that was. They could not hit me. That's crazy behavior. Uh, Shadow Punch. Will-O-Wisp. I'm Quiver Dancing. Looks like we did end up using all the Pokemon. Besides Bowser. <laughs> besides Bowser. Keep him in the back, honestly. Shadow Puncha. Wow, that did a little damage, buddy. And then now we get to win. Big energy ball. But yeah, I mean, I went with Lilligant. I went with Peach for Lilligant instead of something like Gardevoir. Because she's got a crown on her head. It literally looks like Peach's crown. Like, you can't really tell from the back, I guess. But from the front, she looks just like Peach. You know what I'm saying? Iron Soul. I love that nickname, bro. That is sick. That is a dope nickname. It's too bad you're dead. It's very unfortunate. But you will be dying here. Yeah. And if they had no guard... My Lilligant couldn't miss against them, so that's pretty cool. My other Lilligant, I should say. So, I mean, hey, everyone besides Bowser did something, which is very, very lore accurate, lore accurate to the to the Mario franchise. So, let's fucking go. Shout out to Melody for the battle, and uh, let's try to get another one in. Wow, second Dusknor sighting of the day. Kind of insane when you really think about it out loud. Um, They have, an, they also have a Blastoise almost in the same position, so we were so close to greatness, guys. Um, wait, do I have... 
I know I said earlier that uh, the thing didn't make, yeah, it didn't make it zero IVs and in HP either. What the fuck, man? All right, whatever. Well, it was supposed to be the Proba Pass so that it could die quicker. But um, it did not do it, unfortunately. So it is what it is. Very disappointed. Uh, <laughs> that doesn't really matter, obviously. All right, let's see how this goes. Uh, rocks look amazing once again. Um, they could go for screens with um that guy, fucking dude, snowman. But we'll see what happens, guys. We'll see what happens. Ethan, I guess in this in the first battle, I could have preserved my Custap because they obviously were going for Aqua Jet. You know what I mean? So I could have preserved it. They do lead off with the Yabama Snow. All right, we're leading off with it's a me, a Mario. That sounded more Italian than I needed it to be. Um. We go for rocks or T-Wave first? I could miss the T-Wave. We go for T-Wave first. Hey, we're faster. Nice. So they have no speed investment. So we are max speed. Modest nature max speed. But max speed nonetheless. Um, but yeah, they're probably going to get their screens up. Yeah, that's fine. We can waste these turns. Um, it's like kind of scary. It is very scary actually. But we can waste these turns. Hopefully they earthquake me and I can get my cuss step going. Let's see what happens. They do Earth Power. Same shit. Different day. Big cuss that about to happen here. Big cuss that mo moments, dude. Come on. Steel Beam, baby. The crazy thing about Steel Beam is... I'm going to talk about it. And if it happens here, it'll be so funny. Let's see. Oh, they Ice Sharded. That's interesting. Okay, I was going to say anyways. If you miss Steel Beam, you still lose HP. Which is genuinely unhinged and insane. So they have... Earth Power, Ice Shard, Aurora Veil. Probably a special grass move, but if it's just Ice Shard, what if I just Quiver Dance right now and see what happens? You know what I mean? Like, what if we just Quiver? Is it is it going to be an Ice? Like, are they going to have a second Ice move with Ice Shard, or are they going to have a grass move? Because if they don't have... Because, like, oh, yeah, yeah, I, I want to know, I guess, right? Because, like, if they have the... Um... If they have the ice move, I set up with Bowser. If they have the grass move, I set up with Peach. So I guess we could use Breloom to scout. Although Breloom looks like super fucking good here. Um, I guess we could use this to scout, right? Because they would totally click the ice move if they have it. So yeah, let's go out of this. Actually, let's shed... T let's be a scumbag. Oh, perfect. They tried ice sharding. Nice. So now we just get the Shed Tail Scumbag Lee with Bowser Jr. And I'm gonna say they don't have a second ice move. I'm gonna I'm gonna assume they have a grass move. So I'm gonna go for the peach. I'm going for the peach. Bowser definitely looked like it could do it a lot easier here, but I'm just gonna go for the peach, man. My mind, my mind is in control. My heart is I don't remember the lyrics. Uh one more turn of Veil. So they don't have light clay either. That's interesting. Um, quiver. Bro, they keep trying to ice shard me. And they will never be able to ice shard me. I don't care who you are. You can't ice shard me? Alright, so let's give him max HP. Plus one. Plus one alluring voice doesn't necessarily kill. I really don't want to tear it here. Okay, there's no stop. Never mind. We, we, they can never Veil. Okay, so... Is Veil gone, though? Veil is still up for three more turns. Okay, so... We shall Quiver again. Okay, so this is... This guarantees... That they 100% don't have Blizzard. Or I guess... No, actually, that's not true. Because they could have missed it there. Well, they should have went for it last time instead of the Ice Shard. But Regardless, I could totally, like... What's it called? Wait, at plus two, do I even kill? I could totally tear it here. I just don't know if it's worth. It might be. It genuinely might be. Fuck it. We ball. I'm quivering again. Fuck your ice shot. I go acapella. If they get full paired here, I'm going to be very upset. But I think at plus three. And, and with screens gone, we win the game, I think. Maybe, maybe Snowlax would live, depending on what like, its spread is. I assume it would be spadef invested. Or not spadef invested. I assume it would be, obviously, max HP at the very least. Oh my god. Okay, I mean, honestly, we could quiver again if we're feeling it. How many turns of screens left? Two? Bro, Peach? Peach is, make, 
Peach is getting her own game soon, isn't she? This is why. This is why, bro. Yeah, one more Veil turn. I mean, I'm at plus three, right? Like, I should I should preserve my HP. Oh, yeah, I should preserve my HP. I don't give a fuck what happens after this. Yeah, they didn't even shard. Nice, they earth-powered. All right, whatever. Could have probably got another Quiver Dance, but I don't know. Maybe plus three is enough for Bowser. Bowser. Snorlax. I don't know. I'm not a doctor. Look at it. Snorlaxingtons. If you are maximum spadef, we do fucking nothing with plus three energy ball. Oh, no, that's what screens them. We two a KO if they're max spadef. And if they're just max HP, uh, we do, we do, we might kill if it's just max HP. So guess what we're going for, chat? Um, I could have luring voice, but that doesn't do anything because we will go first. Be just max HP. Oh, so close. That was a roll in their favor. Oh, big citrus. Are they going to click earthquake here is the other question I have. High horsepower. Okay, that was brave of you. That was very brave of you. Goodbye, soldier. Um, so I really don't want them to do anything crazy. So I'm just gonna go into my guy here. And click bullet the seed. That's crazy. We literally needed the quiver dance again. If I just quiver dance one more time, Lilligan genuinely would have swept. So that's pretty funny. Um Learn something new every day. Serving it up, Gary's way black. All right, bullet seed. Yeah? Yeah. It's just safer in case they want to tear a ghost for no reason. Or they go out into the other guy. Which I should be faster than, and I will promptly spore. Ain't no fucking way you got, uh, you're a grass type. You know what I mean? If it's just 2k, I'll, I'll go for that, though, instead. But I guess they could tear a fire, so I might... Eh, nah, I'd, I'd probably just bullet seed. That looks like a 2k to me. They honestly probably... Oh, big, big crit. We actually might just... Oh, we, yeah, I think we just kill now. Because that... Oh, I don't have loaded dice. That's right. What am I saying? Okay, so they could totally Shadow Sneak to break Sash. Which they probably should. Um, But I'm just... I'm just clicking Bullet Seed, man. They don't. Wow. I get a Spore off on something. That's crazy. Unless they, like, are Terra Grass on Blastoise and they want to go out into that and, and do it and do the do. Uh, They could do that. Let's see what happens here, man. I mean, I feel like if you go Blastoise in front of this, you have to be Terra Grass. Or at least, a like, you're going to Terra of, so like, of some sort. Um, So I think they'd go into, like... What do they even go into? Are they going to Blastoise? Like, what do I do here, man? I want to Spore, but... If they're the what's it called, I'm going to be very upset. Damn, I already Terra... If I just Quiver Dance one more time, bro, I think I won the game. That's very upsetting. Are they Terra Grass? Like, they gotta be. Whatever. We'll find out. The terrestrializing to some variety. Don't be Terra Grass, please. Oh, perfect. Wait, that's amazing for us. Huh? Okay, we should be faster because we're jolly. And I think they're base 68, right? Yeah. Yeah, get spored, buddy. Get fucking spored, buddy. Bro, Bowser will not get out of his Pokeball for this game, by the way. Genuinely won't. It's so funny, actually. Um, Now we just match punch, dude. This should 2 KO. Yeah. They could wake up immediately, which they do. Do they Shell Smash? They Flash Cannon. Oh, this is the um the raid one. Wasn't it Terra Steel in the raid? Whatevs. Uh, we match punch again. I guess I could Spore. Oh, they switch. Okay. Into what? Right here. Sir, I'm a grass type, don't you know? You're not faster than me. I don't care if you pop your weakness policy here, buddy. Like, hello? What are you doing? Rocky Helmot. Okay. That's very brave of you. I'm actually very proud. I will keep Breloom in the back. Guess what? You're getting seated, bro. Dude, Yoshi put in some fucking work work. If they go into Rotom... Like, that's the only thing they can go into. They can't go into anything else. Everything else dies. Snorlax still alive? No, right? They gotta go into Rotom. I have a grass type in the back. Surely I should be okay. I'm going into my, my dragon. Um, going into my Bowser Jr. Bowser's not... Bowser's staying in the back, dude. Both battles. Bowser's not coming out of his Pokeball. 
I was low I low key wanted to put Blastoise on the thumbnail because I was like, oh yeah, we'll put we'll put Probo Pass for Mario and then Blastoise for Bowser. You know what I mean? But I guess we're putting Mario and Peach, dude. All right, so we're knocking this fucking guy off immediately. Immediately. Um, we could Shed Tail too, which would be very funny. But yeah, let's do this. Let's knock it off immediately, and then we can Shed Tail, maybe, depending on what they do. Rotom's leftovers. They do Will O' Wisp, bro. Bowser Jr. dodges Will O' Wisp for a living. It's actually insane. And I and the fact that I clicked Shed Tail twice in this game just proves that I am such a dirtbag. I think I'm gonna go onto my Lily Gant and just click the fucking buttons, man. Loosen up. Wait, there's three Mons still alive on their side, huh? Who is it? I'm giving Lilligant the chance to, to to be great. Look at her. Daisy, I mean. Not Lilligant, my bad. Um, Hydro Pump. Does that break sub? It should not. It should not. Fuck, you're so bad. <laughs> Daisy's so frail. Um, We're gonna just land, dude. Oh, she's so good to me. Let's go. We can never lose to the Blastoise either. Because, like, even if we miss, it's already in range of Mach Punch. I think we still kill. So even if they Shell Smash, then it's, like, irrelevant as well. So I'm gonna go off that and just... Eh, maybe they're not in range. Well, maybe after the Rocks they are. Like, I know this resists, but this is Hustle Boosted Daisy. She's a hustler. She's a fucking hustler, bro. Daisy is a hustler. Let's fucking go. Who's the last mod? Did they preserve Snorlax? Did they? Am I tweaking? Is that it? No, there's a last mod. They did. When did they do this? Daisy's a hustler. I believe in her. I believe in the Daisy that believes in me. Let's fucking go, bro. I never doubted her. Not for a second. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go. Mario Team's nice. Bowser did not come out of his Pokeball. I was really looking forward to Terra Electric Blastoise. Not gonna lie. I thought it was gonna be the star of the show. <laughs> but it turns out it was the Lilligans. Um, so, yeah, bros. Happy Mario Day. Happy March 10th. Do they usually do, like, some Mario-esque announcement on March 10th? I honestly don't know. I, I, I just know, like, in recent years is when I've noticed that they call it Mario Day. Like, at least in the at, at past five years. Whatever. I, I talked about this in the intro, probably. With that being said, guys, I'm gonna get about it here. If y'all like what you saw and you saw what you like, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace.